money is created as credit in the present monetary system an equal amount of debt is created, when a debt is paid an equal amount of credit is killed and cease to exist, hence, if all debts are paid there would be no money, credit, in the system. Economists tells us that this is the natural way money is supposed to flow through the society, but applying this to nature make no sense whatsoever. Compare it to the water cycle. Sun, which drives the water cycle, heats water in oceans, soil, and seas. Water evaporates as water vapor into the air. Rising air currents take the vapor up into the atmosphere where cooler temperatures cause it to condense into clouds. The water falls back into the oceans or onto land as rain. The natural flow of water. Let's assume that the water cycle should work as the debt credit based monetary system. This would mean that there will have to be a separate anti wetter cycle parallel to the water cycle. These two parallel systems would cancel each other out if they ever met. This is of course total nonsense but for economists it's not only logical but a natural phenomena. 